A man is also in custody tonight after confessing to killing a woman in Avondale. WLWT News Five's Christy Davis has the chilling 911 call made. We're in the 3600 block of Reading Road in Avondale at the building where police found the victim and the man they believe strangled her. I got into a, into a fight with a with a, a female and and, and um, I heard her. Police were called out to this apartment building just after midnight. It's where they found 44 year old Tina Bond inside of apartment number 16. She'd been strangled. Along with her, they found 53 year old Mark Chambers. I hit her. Uh, I, 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 I strangled her. You strangled her? Is she breathing? No, she ain't. Is she alive? No. It's What's her name? Um, my name is Mark Chambers. Police say Chambers was a friend of Bond. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Residents we spoke to say they saw Bond around the building, but that she was quiet and kept to herself. Now, Chief of Police Jeffrey Blackwell has said he wants to focus more on Avondale to start curbing violent crime, but people living in this building tell us this is the most violent crime they've seen in at least a decade. Reporting from Avondale, Christy Davis, WLWT News 5. Chambers told the 911 operator the two had been smoking cocaine and got into some sort of fight. He says that he's been locked up before. Chambers is now charged with murder. He's scheduled to be arraigned tomorrow morning.